New data from the CDC shows Tennessee leading the nation in school closures and all of it because of COVID-19. Yeah, so right now more than 400 schools statewide have closed for at least a day. News Channel 5's Amelia Young live for us this morning. And Amelia, what else does this data show? Yeah, well, it's important to note that while uh, this data shows the South leading the country in school closures, many of those districts did start before other parts of the country, giving them the opportunity to have more cases uh, during that time. You can see in this nationwide graph on your screen, it measures cases in schools from August until mid-September. Tennessee soars past all other states with more than 400 schools reporting a closure. Georgia, Kentucky, and Texas follow in that top four. Nationwide, this data shows most public and private schools, specifically 96%, have remained open for full in-person learning. An estimated 1,800 schools have had to close nationwide because of COVID-19 outbreaks. Again, keep in mind, Tennessee makes up for more than 400 schools in that total. To prevent COVID-19 outbreaks in schools, CDC recommends strategies including vaccinations if ages apply, universal indoor masking, testing, and physical distancing. Now, this all comes at a time where one there's one week left of Governor Lee's executive order allowing parents to opt out of mask mandates in schools. But in several districts, however, uh, lawsuits, lawsuits have struck uh, those down. Back to you in the studio.